Ladies and gentlemen, please welcome Loop Energy President and CEO, Mr. Ben Nyland. Welcome, everybody. I'm very excited to be here today to announce the launch of Loop Energy's latest fuel cell product and to tell you what a game changer we expect it to be. What you'll see today is a fuel cell system that finally enables hydrogen to be competitive with diesel fuel cost in commercial vehicles. I'd like to start by telling you about Loop Energy. Loop Energy is a new generation of fuel cell company with class-leading e-flow technology, delivering proven high fuel efficiency and power output. Loop Energy's patent-protected e-flow technology is a design innovation that sits right at the heart of a fuel cell system, the bipolar plate. E-flow is a mechanical innovation that manages the flow of gases through the fuel cell more efficiently. In Loop Energy's first generation of products, this resulted in up to 16% better fuel efficiency, up to 90% more peak power, and longer lifetime than our competitors' fuel cell product offerings. With this next generation, we're seeing even more improvement in those categories. We set the pace for product performance, customer care, and overall market transparency because we believe that these are critical not only to Loop's success, but to the success of the fuel cell industry overall. We were the first fuel cell company to publish our fuel consumption numbers for the actual operating power points that our customers operate at. We support our customers with drive cycle modeling and fuel cell versus battery sizing designed to give them the best economics for their solution as opposed to the opportunity for us to sell the biggest and most expensive fuel cell. We do this for free because we believe helping our customers make the right decision is critical to both of our success. We've established this level of transparency because it's essential for customers, policymakers, and investors to have a full understanding of the opportunities, the risks, and the timelines to get critical mass in the fuel cell industry. Our fuel cell engines are powering buses and trucks around the world today. We've focused on designing fuel cells for commercial vehicles for three main reasons. The first is that commercial vehicles as a category are one of the major contributors to carbon emissions that are driving global warming today and climate change. The second, Continued dependency on fossil fuels for transportation is contributing to energy insecurity all around the world. And the third, commercial vehicles are ideally positioned to transition to zero emissions because fuel cells and hydrogen meet the operational requirements that batteries alone cannot. And the products that Loop Energy is bringing to market also meet the economic requirements of the commercial vehicle market. Today, I'm here to let you know that Loop Energy has made another significant leap forward in the zero emission commercial vehicle market. Ladies and gentlemen, I'm very pleased to present to you the Loop Energy S1200. The S1200 is the culmination of years of focused engineering effort, testing, and requirements gathering from commercial vehicle manufacturers and com commercial vehicle operators. We believe it's resulted in our newest fuel cell system being a catalyst to drive the transmission or transition to zero emissions. Delivering fast, easy integration into today's commercial vehicle platforms with versatility through its compact packaging, flexible configuration, and factory pre-programming. The Loop Energy S1200 is truly the embodiment of the company that created it. This leads to much faster vehicle integration times, 
getting zero emission vehicles into the market today. To start the transition requires not only great technology and products, but customer service that speeds integration, deployment, and builds trust. Most importantly, we believe that the Loop Energy S1200 achieves breakthrough fuel cost parity with diesel years before expected by the industry, removing one of the most challenging barriers to adoption of zero emission commercial vehicles in the truck and bus market. Continuing in Loop's spirit of transparency, we want to share with you today the efficiency of the S1200, not just at one or two conveniently picked operating points, but across the entire spectrum of operation. The Loop Energy S1200 system is designed to deliver what we believe is an industry-leading peak efficiency of 60%. I'd like to describe for you, for a moment, what this graph you're looking at is saying. Because peak module efficiency is only a part of the story. But unfortunately, it's the part of the story that our industry has tended to talk about almost exclusively. Even more important than peak efficiency is the net efficiency over the entire operating spectrum that the fuel cell will be operating. And that's what you're looking at in this chart. We've divided this into two ranges. The first is cruise mode. Cruise mode is where a vehicle operator can expect to spend most of their time when operating the vehicle. The acceleration range is where they would be accelerating to highway speed or climbing hills, mountains, etc. Having such high efficiency over the entirety of the cruise range means that many commercial vehicle operators can expect to achieve fuel cost parity with today's diesel vehicles at today's fuel prices, both diesel and hydrogen, when using vehicles powered by the Loop Energy S1200. Hydrogen production cost projections mean that this fuel cost parity point has been predicted to be up to eight years from now. So maybe we should be referring to the S1200 as a time machine. It appears to have moved us eight years into the future. So welcome everybody to the year 2030. You may wonder if diesel engine manufacturers claim that their engines are up to 50% fuel efficient, how can fuel cells with what is apparently similar efficiency numbers compete on a fuel basis and achieve parity at today's fuel prices? What diesel engine manufacturers don't like to discuss is that those 50% engines get put into a mechanical drivetrain that is very inefficient. And what that means is in most commercial diesel vehicles, the tank to wheel fuel efficiency is not 50%. It's actually typically less than 30%. The electric powertrains that fuel cells, including our fuel cells connect to, are much more efficient. They can be 80, 90, or even more than 90% efficient. Meaning that a vehicle powered by a Loop Energy S1200 fuel cell system, the tank to wheel efficiency can be as much as 54%, almost double the efficiency of the tank to wheel for a diesel vehicle. In an energy constrained world, I think one thing we can all agree on is that we're gonna be far better off if we have zero emission vehicles achieving more than 50% efficiency with our fuels than if we have emitting vehicles achieving less than 30%. In addition to this efficiency, Loop's eFlow technology also delivers continuous power in the S1200 at 100 kilowatts, with the ability to, to run at 120 kilowatts for sustained periods of time. This is critical to give commercial vehicles not only the ability to accelerate the highway speed, but even more importantly, to be able to sustain speed climbing hills or mountains. A commercial vehicle that can only reliably operate on level ground has a very limited set of customers. The S1200 delivers the power required by commercial vehicle operators and the efficiency 
required by commercial fleet operators, bringing together both of Loop's core mission statements, the power to move you and the engine that drives zero emissions. We believe that the Loop Energy S1200 is truly a product for our times. We do not have time to waste as a society. Climate change is an existential threat, unleashing tragic consequences around the world today. Now is the time to act. To counter climate change, governments around the globe have enacted strict regulations, many of which are required to be in place by the year 2030. In addition to this, major fossil fuel suppliers consistently put self-interest above all else, resulting in critical energy security issues around the globe. The fuel cell industry, in many ways, is still in its infancy, and a tremendous amount of work needs to be done to scale our solutions to address climate change and energy insecurity. But make no mistake, the deployment of fuel cells at scale can rapidly curtail emissions in the coming years, not decades. With the S1200, what you are looking at is one piece of the puzzle that we all need to put together in order to put climate change and fossil fuel driven energy insecurity in the rearview mirror. Thank you for your time today. <laughs>